Check that out. That's like it's like playing an anime. Oh my god, I love this so much. I'm telling you, Resident Evil, but it's happy. What a concept. And there's corn. Ink ribbon. It's July 23rd. Technically, we're still in summer. So I wanted to share this game with you guys. I know you saw the title and you're like, what? But just give me a second. Alright, you won't see this, but this is going to take forever to film because I'm going to be using my phone to translate half of the stuff on screen. So this game is called Boku no Yatsu Natsumi, which translates to uh, my summer vacation, if you're a boy, because Boku is for boys and Watashi is for girls, and I don't know where Japan is on the whole gender thing, so that's all I know. But you play as this kid who goes to his grandparents' farm for his summer vacation, and you get to you get to catch bugs, and you get to swim, and have a good time. It's a very relaxing game, and it is a Japanese exclusive, and it makes me so sad that we didn't get this in the U.S. Because I would have loved a game like this. If you're someone who's interested in learning Japanese, it's very, very simplified Japanese, and it is a fantastic way to practice, especially the reading, because they don't use a lot of kanji, which is more for, like, adults and stuff. Um, but yeah, this was for the PS1, they have it for the PS2, the PS3, and even the PSP. Alright, we're just gonna skip the cutscenes. <laughs> if you want to watch them, there are, I'm, I'm sure they're on YouTube. Whoa, suddenly PS1 graphics. So this is your dad talking to your grandpa, being like, I remember coming to this farm when I was a kid, and now here's my kid. Something about being hungry in an airplane. <laughs> Let me tell you, I struggled living in Tokyo so much. You have no idea. I just never knew what was going on. Oh my god, these games always have the longest intros. Just get to the point. I can't even... Ugh. All right, I can finally play. Now, you guys can see what I mean about Resident Evil, but it's a happy summer game. Check it out. Tank controls, fixed camera, you're in a cool house. I literally would love to make a game like this, where it plays like Resident Evil, but it's happy. Because a lot of the Resident... Ooh. Okay, apparently this is the menu. Oh god, how do I get out of it? A lot of the Resident Evil players are really happy... Oh god. Happy, nice people, you know? And not everything has to be scary. Well, I mean, Resident Evil... Oh, that's cool! Did you guys see that? That was sort of like the door opening cutscene. Alright, there is a run button. We Adventure! Oh man, this is actually kind of sad with everything going on in the world right now, like... This would actually be a, a wonderful place to visit. Which is another reason that I wanted to play this game for you guys. Oh my god, there's a cow and a chicken! Oh my god! Hi, buddy! The cow likes me. Let's say hi to the chicken. Hello, chicken. Yeah, you go, girl. You peck that floor and lay those eggs. Mm-hmm. So, I looked all over the internet to see if there was uh, fan translations or anything, and I couldn't find anything. I think someone started working on one, but never finished it, which is really sad, because I would love to see more of this. Um... I was playing a little bit of this on the PSP. Oh, take your shoes off because you're in the house now. I operate by those same rules. Keeps your floors very, very clean, let me tell you. Oh, we're all having dinner. Oh my god, Japanese food. Itadakimasu, hi. Itadakimasu is what you say before you eat. And it literally means, like, thanks for the food. Wait. 
or is it after? So before you eat, you say itadakimasu. After you eat, you say gosho sama deshita. One of those is thanks for the food. Gosho sama deshita. I told you. And the, the dishes just magically did, did themselves. How convenient. Oh my god, this is like Persona vibes. This feels exactly like Persona 4. Holy crap. What is going on? What is she watching? What are you watching? Haha, <laughs> 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 you can't see the TV. I'm in the way because I'm your brother, I think. Do you want to take a bath? Um, sure. Fun fact, Japanese bathrooms are completely waterproof. Um, you can spray the entire room and it's completely fine. And because of this, hotels in Vegas had to uh, mount the shower heads. So you go to any hotel in Vegas, you can't remove the shower head and spray it around because of Japanese people coming to spray the whole bathrooms and ruining everything. <clears throat> Don't remember where I learned that, but just teaching you guys the wisdom that has been bestowed upon me by some guy. Alright, so I just had to look it up and uh, apparently his picture diary is how you save the game. I did not know that. Aw, puppy. Uh, yes. Alright. That's that. Do you want to continue playing the game? Yes! I'm making a YouTube video. Oh my god, I love PS1 pre-rendered cutscenes. Whoa. I take it I take it back. That's terrifying. What is going on? As far as I know, synchronized morning dancing with your family is not a normal Japanese thing, but I'd never lived in the countryside. Also, I'm not Japanese, so, uh, I don't know. <laughs> oh, that food. Mmm. See, this is so nice. You have nice meals with your family, but they're actually, like, people you want to be around. And it's a nice house, and there's nature, and... Thank you. Thank you for applauding my criticizing of my own culture. <laughs> All right, who wants shots? Okay, I'm guessing by the cutscene of the gate opening that I can leave now. Oh, yay, freedom. Haha, <laughs> you guys will never see me again until I need food, bye. Now we can get to the what I wanted to show. Like, check that out. That's like it's like playing an anime. Oh my god, I love this so much. I'm telling you, Resident Evil, but it's happy. What a concept! And there's corn. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Go around it. Okay, we're not going that way. I have a bee phobia in real life, so that's actually really scary. This was supposed to be a happy game. What the hell? Ooh, a watermelon patch. Oops, I didn't know I could run on them. Sorry. Wait, what? Wow, this says to not get close to private house. Like... That's like literally like a sign, like, get off my lawn, this is private property. Whatever that is in Japanese, that's what that sign said. Hmm. 
Now you guys look at this game and tell me if this isn't the most relaxing shit you've ever seen. Especially if you're a Resident Evil no. fan. Um... <laughs> so my Google Translate says, I'm like, I can't go past here. <laughs> it turned him into a valley girl. Can I go swimming? Ooh, they got so many pre-rendered cutscenes. It's so fancy. That's it. There are a lot of tombstones and graveyard memorials and stuff. I'm not sure what that says about the local community, but I'll just assume that's because a lot of old people live here. Uh oh. He stumbled into a crackhead's den. Oh, local bad guys. <laughs> it actually is a crackhead's den. We're just gonna leave. Oh, I guess it's time to go home. Japanese games really like to be on a schedule, don't they? Wow, this is so much brighter without my sunglasses on. Alright, time for bed. I love this stair cutscene. It's probably, like, literally the most Resident Evil thing in this whole game. I want to take this net, but I don't know how. He just looks at it. Alright, let's draw a picture so you can save your game. Today I laid around and did nothing. Good night. Let's go see what's up with those bees. I wonder if I can get stung by them. Cause I don't, ooh. Oh my God, are we picking the corn? Oh, oh, she got those start. Oshigoto is job. So they're like, you want to be on this farm? You better work, bitch. I didn't know I was going to be picking corn today. This is so sudden. I swear, if they rate me on my performance, I'm going to be so mad. They're going to be like, well, we're having corn for dinner. You're getting nothing. I promise I'm okay. I'm a happy person. I just <laughs> I'm realizing my jokes my jokes are kinda dark, so I'll stop with that. Wait, what did they say? Does this mean I can go now? If you'll excuse me, I have a nest of bees to attend to. Really? Well he's braver than I am, I wouldn't have gotten that close. I'm the type of person that, like, if anything even bee-like flies near my head, I scream and flail my arms and run away as an automatic, involuntary response. And I hate it. Uh-oh, sirens. Ah, oh, the sound of cicadas. The sound of cicadas really is like the sound of summer in a lot of places. I don't know if they're in America, but in Japan, I mean, you can hear them exactly like this. I think in America, the sound of summer is like a lawnmower running over a flip-flop. All right, I'm just gonna watch TV and hang out. What's for dinner? Is it corn? Are you making corn for dinner? Oops. No. I don't I I know I said something with meat. Oh, it's dinner time. What's for dinner? That's not corn. Oh, 
Uh, it's so frustrating when you just understand like every 20th word. <laughs> like I know what words were said, but I have no idea what the conversation was about. Today I picked corn. The end. Good night, beautiful world. <laughs> I want some food. Why is the music so loud? <laughs> Like they're talking to each other, they're like, What? <laughs> I think that's their dead grandparents or grand grandparents, great grandparents, whatever. Wait, what? Did she just kick it? <gasps> what a little whore. Now, I'm no doctor, but I'm pretty sure that was not very respectful. <laughs> She must take a picture of something, someone. In case you wanted to know, the word for cheese in Japanese is cheese. It's also the word for map. It can get very confusing. <laughs> Especially in video games, because I'm like... They're either talking about a map or they're talking about cheese. Sometimes you don't know which one. Oh, wait. I want to see what's for dinner. And if I can make the choice this time. What is that? It's the corn I picked. Alright, today's food. Wait, what is she asking? What do you think of my dinner today? So I think it's like, what do you want for dinner today? Uh, chilled Chinese noodles, stir fried oyster oil with pork and cabbage, or spring rolls and hapo vegetables. Mmm. Let's go with. Ooh, it's summer. Chilled Chinese noodles. I know that sounds weird, but there's this dish called somen. Oh. Somen is like cold noodles, and on a hot summer day, it is the most refreshing meal ever. Oh my god, I'm getting hungry playing this. Oh my god, kakigori is so good. That's like Taiwanese shaved ice. Oh. I think they're asking me what flavor. Oh wait, I can read this. Lemon, melon, midori. Isn't that just melon? And ichigo, strawberry. Okay. Um, shaved ice. Let's say melon. Where's my shaved ice? You can't promise a kid shaved ice. What kind of family is this? <gasps> it's the shaved ice! Oh my god. I would like 10, please. Mm. You know, I can't really understand anything that's going on because of the language barrier, but I'm still feeling so much relaxation and peace from this game. If there's people out there who can do a fan translation of this, of any of them, like I said, it's on several different PlayStation systems. I think, I think we need it. I know I do. All right, yeah. one one more day, and I'll I'll stop this this video. I just wanted to show you guys this game because, well, you can see why I wanted to show you guys. What's in here? Whoa. That's a lot of pots. 
my father is a pothead. Or, I'm sorry, my grandpa. Somewhere in there, he said that he loves an airplane. Great conversation, Grandpa. I'll talk to you later. Oh my god, I found a whole new area. Whoa. So I'm pretty sure that if you catch bugs, you can like make them like sumo wrestle and stuff, which is pretty cool, but... Because I don't know how to use my butterfly net. Water. I really wish I knew how to equip the net or take the net with me. Alright. Okay, I will go ahead and stop this video here. I just, I really wanted to show you guys this game because it is so deeply relaxing and if you speak Japanese, awesome. But even if you don't, I recommend you check it out and just try it a little bit. There, I know that this game has a lot more to offer than what I've shown you. I just don't know how to access it because there's not really a lot of guides in English and yeah, but this is Boku no Natsu Yasumi and it's an amazing series that is Japanese exclusive. If there are English translations out there and I didn't know about them, please, please let me know. But uh, I'm going to stop this here and I hope you guys are all doing great. Until next time, I'm Kai Morgan and as always, thanks for watching Ink Ribbon. And a very special thank you to my bronze, silver, and gold Patreon supporters. Thanks to you, I can make videos without worrying about demonetization and grow my channel faster.